Okay guys, welcome back. Today we're going to do uh, surface exercise 8 and it's going to be of this part over here. Alright, so let's get into this. Start off by creating a, our part. I want to name this part surface exercise 8. And let's start off by adding a datum plane. This is going to be 12 millimeters. Let's add a sketch to the bottom plane. I'm going to use ellipse. What is the ellipse going to be? Six. This one's going to be <coughs> four. There we go. Let's add another one, another sketch. Lips. And this one's going to be sixteen and ten. Let's exit. Now let's get to the top plane here. Twenty-four. Let's exit. I'm just drawing all the sketches that I need first, and then we will move on to the surface modeling. Create an arc here and here, and I want to say it's going to be 25. Let's exit. I'm going to mirror. This sketch for this plane. There we go. Another sketch. Start on this plane. Create an arc. Here and here. I'm going to say this is going to be radius 40. Let's exit. I'm going to extrude. Asymmetrical. I'm going to extend these edges a little bit more. Yeah, by two, a little bit more. There you go. Now, I want to go to wireframe and I want to project this ellipse onto this face. And we can erase, eliminate the face. All right, there we go. All right. Let me just blank. Some sketches here. Okay, there we go. Don't need. Make another sketch. This face. And this time I'm going to say. Uh, choose reference. Reference single. This one. I'm going to choose this plane. exit I'm going to do the same thing on this side here on this plane reference entity 
entities that we've got. Arc from here to here, and it's going to be 20 radius as well. So they basically intercept there. Let's exit. Let's create curve mesh. I'm going to choose this and this sketch and the V curve is going to be this one. Do this again, curve mesh. Okay, there we have it. Let's close the bottom part here inside now let's close this top here I'm going to use the <coughs> FEM patch I want to choose this boundary I want to choose this curve and this curve there we go that's what I'm looking for Projections. Let me just blank these two sketches as well. Just blank all the sketches. Mirror. All right, everything seems to be sealed off. That's good. All right, so I'm blank this. Now I'm going to extrude this. By one and remove. Okay. Now we're going to do that little dome over here in the center. Um, I could have done. I could do this by by doing a sketch, but I want to simplify things, and I want to create uh, a solid. So the sketch, the surface. Sorry, uh, a surface. I could have done this by doing a surface, but the surface part was the this whole bigger part, and I'm gonna use a solid to do this one. All right, so I'm gonna go to Lipsoloid here. Before I do this. Let me just add a point. And we'll need this point by four millimeters. There we go. Now I've got a shape. Say that this is 8, 12, 8, 12, and 8. That's correct. And I'm going to add this to what I've already done. There we go. Okay, so now to finish off, I'm going to finish off using uh, fillet. I want to say it's going to be 0 0.5. I want to put fillets everywhere. And 
including the bottom part. All right, there we have it. Let's change color here. Okay guys, this is exercise eight of this very simple part for beginners. I hope you enjoyed this and until next time, goodbye.